This is artist Dennis Pendleton. I'm here at the Art Students League of Denver where I teach watercolor classes. And tonight I want to show you how to mix grays. And this is just one of my short videos, runs about two or three minutes, where I show you one thing you can use in your watercolor painting. So this is cerulean blue. And I like cerulean blue by Holbein. And this is cadmium red by Winsor Newton. And the red's a lot stronger. So I'm gonna add it very carefully in here. And you can see it's already turning gray. So that's a nice gray mixture. And I was taught by my mentor, Lowell Ellsworth Smith, to mix my grays instead of buying them. You can buy Davies Gray and Payne's Gray, but I like to control the temperature, whether it's warm or cool. And this is some yellow ochre. I'm gonna put some yellow ochre in that same mixture, and it'll just warm it up a little bit and make a different gray kind of a stony gray. And then for a darker gray, I mix ultramarine blue with burnt sienna. And again, I can make it warmer, cool. If I want it warmer, I put more of the burnt sienna in it. If I want it cooler, I put more of the ultramarine blue in it. So there's a couple different mixtures you can use to make grays. And grays are used in painting to show off the other colors. So it's important to learn how to mix grays. So this is artist Dennis Pendleton. You can look at my website, dennispendletonstudio.com. You can sign up for free watercolor lessons that come out every Sunday. So this is Dennis saying, keep on painting.